minutes, so let's start over. So, hello there, everyone. This is Phantom Duos here, and I'm here with PWY. I, um... This is our literally, yeah. this is literally our second shot. <laughs> <laughs> I, I really don't yeah. like when that happens. So, yeah, yeah. this is going to be the Take 3K subscriber special, and thank you to PWY. Um... I don't. I really don't feel like going over this. So let's just say that um, Phantom Bill found out that um, it's going to take a long time to figure out what to do with the this 3K special he's originally been planning on doing. Yeah, I really got a mind. I literally got a headache from doing that. So thank you to PWY. So since oh, this man, is right. so this is yeah. this the reason why we're doing a second shot was because the first one passed on us. Uh, I'm so dumb. Sorry about that, PWY. That's no, fine. The accidents are very. I find it funny. <laughs> so yeah, this is going to be the first part, and the link to PWY's channel is gonna be in the. It's in the uh, gonna be in the description. This is this thumbnail. You should just look up my name. <laughs> this chat, the thumbnail was made by him. The ship, him, and I'm helping with the story. Uh huh. So 100%. yeah original like you can look up yourself it's 100 percent original we had a three water first searching it up just to make sure and that's what we have to say <laughs> so the water is going to start betty betty we're shouldn't we just start the person yeah and just Actually, yeah. and just go People through that don't betray him are the following theme um let me Shoto, I... i'm showing the pictures Fam Todoroki for Deku Najire, the big three don't betray them. Momo doesn't betray them. And basically every hero, uh, Mount Lady and Nanashimura are going to be revived by the Sage of Six Path. And, Shota, and um, Shoto Aizawa. And Shoto Aizawa, we all know he's too lazy to even betray anyone. Plus he's not stupid. He would mm -hmm. know that All Might and Deku are worthy enough and not betray you, eh? So yeah, the and midnight. Mid midnight is probably the only person that I will tell you wouldn't be stupid enough to betray them. Even though we might call her rated our hero, and she doesn't seem that stupid. Yes. So but we're. Like so one thing before PWY continues talking, I want to say that we'll explain how the betrayal goes through flashbacks. Just just through small flashbacks of the past that Izuku and All Might had. It. So we start off with a flashback of All Might. We start off with All Might in the teacher room, or the teacher meeting room. Going over how All Might is a villain and how he's under arrest for taking bribes from the um, villain, uh, like from villains and stuff, and letting them go. It's basically and the it's basically people from the league of, from people from like the lower ranks of the League of Villains or people that work under uh, uh how do you call them? Uh, All for one. Yeah, it's basically lower lower rank villains that are under all for one and overhaul, and uh, n that are working for nine as well. So yeah, continue PW. What? Okay. And um, oh yeah, and we should probably explain. If th this may not make sense at you for first, but I kind of see this working. Um, how 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 um. All Might gets his powers, and Deku gets their powers taken away. Is um, majority of the um, users, one for all users, have to agree that they are not worthy, or if they want the powers taken away from them, so they can do it. But it, it would drain a lot of energy from the users that wanted to be switched with whoever they want to switch it with. And the two people getting one for all would be um, Endeavor and um, to Tokiomi. Yeah, we're seeing Dark Shadow becoming really strong because of this, but not as strong as Madara and not as strong as Madara, aka Toshinari and Izuku, Izuku, Izuku Morning Star and Seisha Six Part and Seisha Six Part. Back, I can't say the name so this well, can I? The most OPS what if is probably it's probably gonna be one of your most OPS what ifs you gonna do for Deku. <laughs> 
I I I hope the comments are kind to me. They don't go that harsh saying that I recorded it up to way too OP. What if? What can't be as OP as your Omni King one, Deku? Ah, uh, trust me, I I went a bit too far for that one. See, ah, uh, let's continue the water, please. So, um, Deku, um, let's just get a flashback, okay? So, um, inside the one for all head, everyone except for the first user and Nana Shimura wants to switch with Endeavor and Tokiomi. And they want to switch it, um, and, um, Nana Shimura and the one, the first one for all user are same. I think, think. this is insane. Like, them both have been shown to be worthy, and they're true heroes. So, why would you want to switch with them to somebody who's a dick and, and somebody who, um, who only has a quirk and only wants to use it for power, which they just state, well, since you guys failed at killing all, which they just replied to Nana Shimon and, um, and the first one, well, they all failed at killing all for one, so we better give it to somebody who will end up killing his ass. <sighs> so you know. I, I'm very disappointed in these one for all users now. So it's my turn. Yeah. That was the two flashbacks of how the betrayal were. The training were, was very simple. It was only one hour, aka okay, yeah, a million years. So over that million years, the gatekeeper, who's an angel, who trained all, who trained all my with Madara. Madara was gifted by the Satyistic Path, Infinite Chakra. And if you're wondering why we're giving him Infinite Chakra, was because there's no way to collect chakra in the, in the My Hero Academia world. Even if we do the plot armor, we can make the pl My Hero Academia world be something like you can collect chakra. And he also gives him all chakra natures because why not? And, and he also got another surprise when All Might gets out of a coma. And yes, All Might should have returned back to his 30s with Nana Shimura going back to her 30s as well. And he's going, and he's not going to have the injuries. Like, Modder already healed the injuries when he entered the mind state. And yes, because forget about the old skinny All Might. He's going to be looking like Mother just with yellow hair. Mm -hmm. Isuku was trained by Morningstar and Sage of Sixth Path, making him have every Kikiyankai and the third eye, which his hair is hiding it. Isn't it? Yes. His hair's and long. Make it disappear. His hair make it disappear. His hair seems long enough to hide it. Yeah, but he could just hide it if he wants to, like chakra. Okay then. And yes, the training with the Sages this path only took Isuku, since we all know Isuku has the biggest mind brain alive. Even though he really doesn't use it in the um, in the anime, he doesn't really use it, which I'm very surprised. Izuku with this type. With Isuku's type of mind, with Isuku's type of mind, he was able to master the Sage Six Paths abilities really fast. Within within a couple thousand years. <laughs> and and basically, since we're, I'm gonna be putting a warning, warning, spoil, spoiler, alert, say it. We're gonna give you, we're gonna give you like, skip like a minute or two ahead. <laughs> Yeah, if you if you don't want to get if you don't want to get a spoiler, skip two or three minutes ahead. Izuku Midoriya right. is Lucifer Morningstar is the is basically God on season five, the last few episodes of it. He became God, so Izuku's gonna be God. And so we're also basing basing what? And also we're basing. This off of like the um, Ten Tails um, Madara, <laughs> yeah, OP as fuck. I know. Yeah, so one to two minutes. I'm gonna put in the description. If you don't want a spoil a spoiler for Lucifer, skip one to two minutes. I really don't want to ruin everybody's chance, but I'm gonna put in the description. Warning, spoiler, and even on the title. Since me and PWY don't want people commenting, why you why you spoiled it for me? We want you. <laughs> so yeah. 
so now that you have skipped those two minutes, we continue. Izuku and Madara, and Izuku, wow, I was so close to, to, to calling all my Madara. Izuku and All Might have now woken up, and by surprise, they were giving the greatest surprise alive. They were in front of a few UA, UA teachers. You want to do? You want to give the uh, speech? All right. So, um, the UA teachers all bowed down and asked if they could be forgiven. Oh yeah, and Inko got her ass killed by Snipe. Yes, because yeah, oh. because Snipe think that. Izuku and All Might are just worthless trash. They decided to betray them just to be with villains. And since we all since we, since we all know a person like Snipe could be the cockiest thing alive, he decided to kill Inko. And don't worry, Inko's gonna be brought by, brought back by Izuku. And Izuku basically his name is gonna be Morningstar. So his name is. Is his name gonna be Morningstar or not? Because I really feel like I'm doing it. I'm not doing it. Yes, Inko and Deku's name are gonna be Morningstar because let's just say that Hasashi Midori divorced them. Oh, he dipped on Inko. Uh huh. So yeah, you don't be getting that club. So yeah, Izuku's name is Morningstar. All my and Izuku looked at each other and just laughed. Basically, just they're laugh. Like, they're like, oh, I, oh. they're like, oh, I, oh, my, he's gonna beat their asses full first, and all my's like, I'm gonna do it first since they beat my ass up. And as we all, all just... and as we all know, Madara's cockiness when it comes to beating someone up, he just cracked his knuckles to the point where everyone has shivers going down their spine. They're like, oh my, aren't you a hero? Aren't you a pro hero? Like, you're not supposed to be doing this. He's like, oh, I thought I was a quirkless nobody without one for all. So how can I be a hero if I'm quirkless? And they'll, they just get shivers down their spines when they hear him say that. And since we all know... I'm sorry, and since we all know that if you're quirkless, beating up a hero won't affect you, because you're not using a quirk. I mean, you can just get like a couple of mutts in for assault, but that's really it. Which ain't no way in hell they can arrest All Might or Deku. They can both body flicker just... or teleport out of there. <laughs> no, they can blow up the whole entire fucking prison, dude. They could just be spamming fucking planetary devastation if they wanted to. Mm, meaning the meaning the meteorite technique will be coming in handy sooner or later. Mm, you already know it. So after the biggest whoop of all the heroes' life, they learn not like, to mess. Not, even, not they learn not to mess not with even. the one and only. I'm sorry, PW. Why you can continue? And also the vill the heroes are like, damn bro, not even villains whipped our asses this bad. Yes. Those and you know, All Might heal them enough. He didn't heal them to where it doesn't hurt anymore. He just healed them to where they wouldn't die. He just did the bare minimum. And let's just say Madara that I was proud, even though he was not with he even though he was no longer in uh and he was basically Madara was wait are we gonna make Madara and the others stay in Izuku and All Might's mind? Yeah. Okay then Madara was very proud of All Might. He's so, like damn bro, he's like a brother to me. So yeah. After that Izuku got up and looked at Snipe and said, You think that I didn't know that you killed my mother? Flashback. Oh, this is gonna be the flashback where Izuku got a box packaged to him by a guard saying, Here you go, you stupid villain. You got a package from Snipe. And as we all know, this package carries through the one and only person's head. Oh, God. 
you say you say this, PWI. I'm really sad. Yes, I came up with this idea, so don't be roasting Phantom Duels for doing this. All right, so uh, let's just say that the Sage of Six Paths, some way, somehow, through Chakra, transported the package into his mindscape. Wait, and, but no. Know, the prison guard just thought that somebody stole it. <laughs> PWI, tell them whose head is in there. Inko Midoriya. Uh, oh. Dun, dun, dun. Yes, this is not all going to be all bloody and stuff like that. Don't worry. This is only the one bloody scene. If We're he... not even going to describe it. We're just going to say it's her head in there. And through plot armor and chakra, the Seisha Six Path revived Inko. Which I'm very this grateful for. Like skinny Inko. This is like skinny Inko where she's her crook got boosted like a hundred times, so she's like, she's like OP as fuck, and she can lift like cars and trucks with ease without even. If you guys have seen happening. that little girl from uh, One Punch Man, the one that has the telekinesis power, that's Inko right there. Inko. Yeah, so, so she's in the definition. She's literally strong as fuck. Like probably within. If she was to join the Hero Society, she could easily get within the second rank, only and, getting behind All Might. And as we all know, that hero from the from the how do you call it? That that little girl from the Saitama world, she's literally an S rank hero. So you can be she expected. She could lift up like she could probably lift up like buildings okay. and stuff with ease. I know, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Sorry about that. If you heard that, so we continue. And um, Inko can fly because like she can use her telekinesis to float. <laughs> so yeah. So we can. So then after that, I think we're gonna have to end it off here because I'm almost about to leave. And and because why not leave you on as little spoiler? And th I'm gonna do a warning. Me and PWI might record the video a bit more later. Yes, after he gets back to where he, to where he's going. I'm gonna I'm gonna put in the title until I come back. That's all. Or maybe if I take my computer to my grandma's house, I might record it. If PWI is not busy. The little spoiler is Izuku and Omai gave the biggest kick of their life to the heroes. And they're going back to UA, right, PWA? Uh huh. So well, yeah. yeah, and they they would kill villains like they just they just don't kill heroes. They're going to the like, anti-hero way. Yes, because like, they, like they don't kill I, like like they won't like kill like Sugar Rocky or like or like um or like Dobby because like come on like they kind of feel bad for them but like anyone who did it by like their own choice so, like Toga and like um muscular yeah they're gonna kill them yeah and I don't think Nana's gonna let him kill Shigaraki it's gonna let all my kill Shigaraki plus I feel like one of the reasons why Shigaraki went down the paths he was was because he didn't have Nana Shimura there to guide him so yeah Thank you guys for watching. This is Phantom Doom PWY. Thank you so much for helping me, PWY. On the 3K special. No <laughs> yeah. This is going to have to work as the 3K special because, um, yeah, we all know why. Yeah, I'm very disappointed in myself. But, yeah, the link will be on yeah. PWY. The link will be on the description. And I'm warning you guys. Spoiler. Skip, the two, skip two minutes or one in the video. Probably one minute. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna pause now.